Hey, 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 what's up everybody? What's going on? This is Tony. And I'm Jenny. And we are La Lita Loca, and we are here today to tell you our top five carnival excursions in Freeport, Bahamas. What? All right, guys, well, we are going on a cruise on the Carnival Liberty uh, February of 2018, mm -hmm. and uh, our good friend Matt Allen suggested we uh, reveal a little bit uh, maybe what excursions we might be doing uh, on the cruise or what excursions we'd like to do. The truth is we haven't picked any yet. No. So we went through a little bit of an exercise. We looked at all the excursions available at Freeport, mm -hmm. and I don't know, how many was it? 30 something? Yeah, it was like 30, mm -hmm. 32, and uh, we did it separately. So Jenny picked out her five, I picked out my five. And so this is gonna be Jenny's top five uh, carnival excursions in Freeport, Bahamas. This is gonna be my top five uh, carnival excursions in Freeport, Bahamas. And the fingers are crossed that maybe we have one that's in common so that we can uh, go on the same excursion. And we also have four other shipmates coming with us this time also. So hopefully they're listening and they can enjoy something we, we need some shipmate uh, input yes so Tony's uh, brother and his lovely bride and my sister your sister and her lovely awesome groom husband. I guess well awesome you can't husband. say lovely groom no okay awesome husband yeah. well hey if this is your first time at the channel uh, please consider subscribing uh, we talk cruising uh, almost on a daily basis uh, we do uh, vlogs cruise vlogs personal vlogs uh, cruise tips and we do stuff like this where we try to figure out the, what's the best thing to do when you're cruising. So uh, uh, hit that subscribe button uh, with the notifications on. Uh, we'll have another video. The, the cruise that we're going on actually has two ports, uh, Freeport one day, Nassau the next day. So we're gonna do the exact same thing with the Nassau uh, excursion. Mm -hmm. So uh, stay tuned for that. Yes. Do you wanna go with your list first? Uh, sure. All right, we got our computers in front of us, so uh, if you see us looking down, uh, we want to just make sure that we give you the right information, and so uh, forgive us for looking away, but we want to keep you informed. Yes. Okay. So the first one that I would like to do is swim with the dolphins. Nice. And that is a three and a half hour excursion, and it's $204.99 per person. Okay. And with that one, what it does, it brings you... Um, from the port on a bus ride um, to Port, port Lucia, and then it, you arrive at the facility. Um, you board a boat and enjoy a 20 minute boat ride um, on the canal system, and then you arrive at the nine acre natural lagoon that you get to swim with the dolphins. That's pretty cool. And then after that, um, of course, there's photographers, that kind of stuff that will take your pictures. Um, I'm sure that's an extra charge. Uh, after, <laughs> right, after your dolphin swim, uh, time permitting, they let you purchase lunch, um, and take a dip in the 17 foot deep pool or browse the shop that's a gift shop that's there. So that one, I, I, I think that would be so cool to be able be to cool. swim in the dolphins. Yeah. Um, I saw Dan Marino once at, in a jacuzzi at a hotel, but I don't think that's the same thing. No, that's no. not the same thing. Because no. I guess if he was in a pool, I could have swum with a dog. Yeah. No. Um, the next one that I chose was um, to tour a brewery and the city and the downtown. Mm. Um, it also brings you through a perfume facility as well. Um, and it gives you a chance to... Uh, make your own perfume and um, then also at the end of the beer which I thought was kind of weird right like a perfume factory and then a beer factory but at the end of the brewery you also get to taste test everything and, and that's kind of cool um, so it's a three and a half hour excursion and it's forty nine dollars and ninety nine cents per person they give you transportation and stuff over they there? do give you transportation and they give you a little tour like going over there so it's kind of like touring and then you also get to go through the brewery which is kind of cool sounds cool yeah um then my next one is garden of the grove sightseeing and shopping tour and that one is a four hour um excursion and we're we're in freeport from eight to five so okay yeah. That's what I was wondering. So we have nine hours. Mm -hmm. So, we, I mean, some of that time is going to be getting off the ship and then we want to get back in plenty of time. Right, right. But, so four hours, I think, is kind of a top one. Yeah. You know? Um, so it's four hours. 
and it's $49.99 a person. And what this one does, um, you take a 30 minute bus ride um, to the facility and you get to see like the tropical flowers and the trees and they give you a tour and there's a waterfall. Um, and then you get to, um, it'll stop on the way back in uh, the marketplace. So you get to shop a little bit too. So that one I liked because you get to see the natural, of uh, you know, the natural flowers and birds and that kind of stuff um, of Freeport. So that was kind of like a little educational one. Perfume and flowers. Well, perfume on the one before and now flowers on this one. <laughs> That's right. I'm sensing a theme. Yes. Then the next one that I liked um, was uh, Glass Bottom Boat. And that one is two and a half hours and it's $39.99 a person. And the reviews that I read about this, so you take a 40 minute um, ride to um, this boat that takes you out. And um, it's kind of cool because a lot of the reviews talk about when the part that they get to feed the sharks. So I kind of liked it only because I'm so petrified of sharks, but it'd be kind of cool to be able to be that close to them and I don't know, just kind of see their, their natural habitat. And, and the last one that I want, and I'm super excited about, and I would really love to do this one, hint, hint, hint. Um, it's called My Bohemian House, a, sele a, a Select Retreat. And it's $99 a person, it's four and a half hours. And what it actually is, it's, it's limited to, I think about 12 people um, from what I was reading. Mm -hmm. And they feed you lunch and like you cook with the chef. And then you also have a bartender that they just deliver you your drinks. But it's a behemoth style house, so it's really secluded. And it has its own beach, um, it has kayaking, and um, like there's uh, snorkeling, and there's only 12 people. And wow. your own chef, and your own bartender, and your own beach. How much, how much was that one? It was only $99 a person. Wow, that's, that seems uh, fairly reasonable. Yes, and the reviews are just wonderful, and that's something that I think I would love to do. I might have to consider that one. Yeah, because I want to see the beach. We haven't seen a beach. We haven't seen a beach. So, okay, cool. That's a good top five. Yes, thank you. So we'll go through mine. Uh, we'll start with the only one that uh, was on my list that was also in Jenny's list. That's the glass bottom boat. That does sound really interesting to me um, to be able to go out on the water, but to still be able to see like sea life mm -hmm. without having to do snorkeling. I, I'm not a real experienced snorkeler or anything like that. I think I could get the hang of it, mm -hmm. but uh, I do like the idea of just being able to jump off and go see. Uh, go see something so right. you know without too much hassle so that's kind of exciting well that's nice yeah so i mean i'm glad we had one in this in the like a, the same i don't think i saw that uh, exclusive beach one i might be might be changing my but so i had i had one that's similar to yours i did the dolphin close encounter mm -hmm. this is a three and a half hour excursion uh, at a cost of 154 dollars and 99 cents a person it's very similar to the swim with dolphins. Uh, they put you on a boat, give you a canal tour, take you out to the big nine acre lagoon. But I guess you don't actually get to swim on this one. I think it's a little less expensive. But you do uh, have a, like a shallow area where you sit and the dolphins come up and you can touch them and uh, you know they take pictures there like you like you mentioned. So I think that one might be better than. <laughs> yeah, I mean uh, only because I would love, I want to swim, with, but if they swim up to you. That's kind of cool. Yeah, it's a, that sounds. Yeah, I like that access aspect of it. I, I don't know, yeah. swimming might be fun too, but uh, yeah, I don't know. Both sound great actually. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's two that are pretty similar. Yeah, and, yeah, two that's similar. And then like you, we haven't really had a beach uh, kind of time on our cruises yet. Right. And so I chose the uh, all-inclusive beach getaway. Uh, this is a four and a half hour excursion uh, for seventy nine ninety nine per person. And basically what they do is they take you on a bus to a private beach. It's all inclusive. It's uh, food and drink and uh, just beach time. Uh, nice. So you can swim. They do have uh, you know, like uh, kayaking and paddle boards, uh, I think for an additional cost, but essentially you get four and a half hours at the beach uh, and you get to drink. So, you know, I felt like for 80 bucks, that was a pretty good value. Yeah. And uh, that would give you some beach time. Nice. Uh, yeah, so kind of cool there. Well, that's similar then to my behemoth house. Yeah, but not like, that thing sounds cool. Yeah, the cooking and mm -hmm. all that kind of stuff. Uh, 
So that's three for me. My number four, uh, and I don't know that you'd necessarily love this one, but this is the off-road ATV Tropical Garden and Beach Break. I saw that one. This is a five and a half hour excursion for $134.99 per person. And basically it's an ATV tour around the island, uh, which sounds like a lot of fun. They, uh, they drive you around. Uh, at one point you do get to have a little beach time, but I think the thing that's more interesting to me is just the ATV tour, <laughs> kind of going through some of the back areas, through some of the some of the woods. And yeah, so the ATV sounds like a lot of fun. Again, I don't know that that if... if well, maybe to, you guys can go on the ATVs a, and the ladies can go to the Behemoth House. Yeah, it could be a good we'll uh, guys thing, I don't know. And then my last one is uh, bottom fishing. So bottom fishing is a four and a half hour excursion. Uh, for $79.99 per person, and it's deep sea fishing. So uh, they, oh. they take you out uh, on a boat and uh, you just do some fishing. Now I haven't, I haven't really done a lot of fishing since I was a kid, and I've never gone deep sea fishing, uh, and so that just sounds like a lot of fun. The reviews look pretty good, and so I thought I thought that would be kind of cool. Do you get to cook that fish when you catch it? I almost feel like it it's bad? a yeah, I think it's a catch and release thing, okay. which is kind of what I'd prefer. You yeah. know, like if we're not gonna eat it or anything, uh, mm -hmm. you know. But um, but yeah, so that sounds like fun. Yeah, so some good options on Freeport. Uh, again, 32 different uh, carnival excursions to choose from. I'm sure there's countless other third party uh, to, to go with. Oh, you know the one thing that's cool about the um, the all-inclusive beach is uh, you can use your sail and sign card there. Like they have a straw market there oh, also. Wow. I just remembered that. And so it, it's, uh, it's one of those you don't even have to have like carry your money there, which is kind of that's pretty. Kinda, that's that's pretty another cool. nice perk. Mm -hmm. but, so what about you guys? Anybody out there been to Freeport? Anybody done any of these excursions? What would you recommend? Please leave a comment below and let us know, or come on over to La Lita Loca Cruising Community on Facebook, and you can follow us on social media at Twitter and Instagram at La Lita Loca. And uh, yeah, so I guess other than that, we'll, we'll see, see you on, on the Lido. Lido.